Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of SNS PC Helpline. I am one of the SNS PC helpers and in this video I'll be showing you how to use Windows Movie Maker 6.0 and also how to get your downloaded intros from FlixPress into Windows Movie Maker 6.0. This was asked by my friend at Weebcraft. Please go subscribe to him. So first of all, you open with Windows Movie Maker. And firstly, I'll show you some basics. So there's these options down the side. Um, import from digital video camera. Import videos, pictures, audio, and music. Edit imported media, effects, transitions, tire, titles and credits. And publish to this computer, blah, blah, blah. There's also the basic um, tools, file, edit, view, tools, clip, play, and help. Um, yep, so um, there's this which gives you the effects, and you just click on any, and uh, transitions. And then um, I'll go quickly make a test video, and I'll come back. So now I have made the test videos, so I'll go get them now. Hello again, this is test video two. Test video two. La 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 la. La 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 la. So those were the two test videos. So now to get them into the thing, you can drag this up to make it bigger. You click and drag, and then it'll come up here. And then, hello again. This, and then you can click the other one and drag it la, 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 la. behind it or in front of it. I'll put it in front of it, so now it's played. La, 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 la. Hello again. This is there. It is now. If you want to make like a transition between them, go into transitions and click one. I'll click dissolve rough and then you hover over the split and then let go and now this should be thing now they should be connected so click play la, la, la. hello again this is test video two and I'll you see that didn't change la, la, la. hello again this is test video two and I'll just hover over all my files and if you use the same background they won't change um, I'll just get another random video to add to the blah 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 blah. So I have got a random video. It's one of my previous bloopers, I think. Yeah, this was what I made for the um one an optional intro. So I can click and drag that in. So now play that. Blah, 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 blah. Now, if I want to add a transition, I can. I'll go. I'll go into flip. Go in between them, and now go back. Now I'll go into this. Now, if I want to add an effect, you can click on any of these. I'll do. I'll do slow down f for the blah blah just to make it sound cool. See, that's really slow now. Or you can do speed up. Double, I'll speed up the second video. So now this is really fast. Okay, there. Now let's get on to some other stuff. You can also add um audio and music. You click on it and you go to you, the file that has it. I'll just go Amazing by Westlife. And then I won't play it for copyright reasons. And then you should play it with the audio from the video. If you want to change it, go to Audio Levels. You can drag this to audio or music and it'll only play the music or audio from video and it'll only play the video audio. So I'll just put it there. And now you and now I want to split a clip. Um if you want to split a clip you go to where where you want to um where you want to split it. Whoops, I accidentally played it. Um sorry, I'll go back to audio levels. Audio from video. Okay, say I want to cut this last bit off, go up here, click split, 
and now you have this is a separate video. Yep. If you have or or audio, you'll split the audio first, and then you need to do it double to get the video split. Now, if you want to delete it, click delete. And now it should be shorter. There. Um. So that is. So when you're done, you go to file, publish movie, and where you want to pu publish it, this computer if you want to, file name, I'll just type, I'll, I'll just call it test video, now publish to, I, I normally publish it to my videos, click next, best quality for playback on my computer, recommended, I click that, publish, and should start publishing it okay that took a while um you have an option of play movie when i click finish i won't click that and then you click finish and you're done just for safety i just click save project and save it just in case i want to do it again or watch it again then you close up windows movie maker i'll just click no but if you want to save it then you click it yes so now i'm going to I'm going to open um, Windows Movie Maker back up. And now I'm going to show you how to get your intros from FlixPress into Windows Movie Maker. So first of all, you need to find out where your intro is saved. Mine saved in... Um, mine saved in Downloads. And it's in alphabetical order, so whatever you call it. Or you could just type it in here. Mine was called like it the um video has your name in front of it. Like your username for Flixpress. Um Yeah. Mine's called Sepster the Author five nine three five one nine. Whatever it um it's named after whatever username you have and um, a random number so I'll open this back up click um, videos I'm sorry for the watermark that happens to me when I um, upload when I click publish movie and then um, I go to the thing and then downloads and then if it, nothing comes up go, go down here and click all files and then go find it here it is, double click or click and import and then it should start loading let's wait for it please don't tell me this is gonna take a long time I'll just click cancel and do it again oh if you click, if you click cancel it comes up anyway so when it comes up you click and drag and then now you can um, edit your videos with the um, intro. That's what I do. I get the videos and then I edit them with the intros in Windows Movie Maker. Epic intro. Okay, so um, yeah, then you just add your videos um, here on this side. Like, I'll just get a random video. Okay, this one, click and drag behind it, and now it has the intro, and then the video. So, um, thank you for watching this video. Um, I hope you have enjoyed it, and I hope I have answered your question. If you have any other problems or questions, post a comment down below or send us a message, and we will um, get back to you. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and thumbs up. And remember, keep computing.